So I'm packing for our two-week trip to Thailand, and everyone keeps asking me um, how I get by with just a carry-on size suitcase for such a long time. So I thought I'd walk everybody through my packing process this, this evening to show you what I was bringing and maybe give you some good ideas for packing for your next trip. Uh, this could be appropriate for any warm weather destination. Um, so as far as clothing goes, I'm bringing three pairs of pants and a skirt, uh, mostly khaki neutral colors, bringing five t-shirts, which might actually be more than I need, but I thought that having an extra one might not be a bad idea, um, given that it's warm and I might want to change shirts more frequently. Over here, we've got a pair of sleep shorts, a uh, swimsuit, um, and I've got four pairs of socks and four pairs of underwear. Now the important part about this is that they're quick drying underwear, they're a, a nylon blend, so that in the evening uh, you can wash them out in the sink and they're dry by the next morning. So every third day or so I just wash the whole, whole lot of them and can get by with just four pairs for the entire trip. Uh, this is the backpack that I travel in. Um, it is carry-on size, it fits on every airplane except for little teeny tiny ones with propellers, so just about every airplane we've been on uh, this fits. Also bringing a pair of sandals and a pair of walking shoes. Always good, important to have, uh, very important to have good walking shoes. Now over on the accessory side of things, for a warm weather destination, I always bring a floppy hat. Uh, I've got my standard quart size bag of toiletries. Uh, of course, I've got the computer with, uh, alarm clock. This is something that's really handy to travel with. Uh, I l always travel with a Tide stain pen, just in case uh, we're not near laundry or uh, <clears throat> something gets uh, gets dirty. Um, got a first aid kit. I always travel with my Airborne uh, separate from my first aid kit, uh, just because I like to have it with me on the airplane um, so I can take it before we take off uh, so it's easily accessible. Uh, I always travel with uh, an eye mask and earplugs just because I'm a light sleeper and uh, we never know in hotels uh, or where we happen to be staying if it's going to be noisy. So I always travel with those. Uh, I've got uh, a towel. Uh, this is a chamois cloth. It's a super moisture absorbent uh, towel uh, just in case we happen to be staying somewhere that doesn't provide towels or we're going to the beach. Um, this absorbs a lot of water. Uh, I've got a travel journal and some reading material and a packable um, extra bag that has a clip so it can clip onto the outside of my backpack. Uh, really handy uh, as a carry-on bag for the airplane to tuck books and last-minute snacks in um, and uh, really handy for shopping too. Uh, folds into a compact, uh, compact size. So this is pretty much it. Um, this is what I'm gonna, gonna work with for two weeks and um, you know, the one thing about packing, never need to worry. Um, as long as you have all the important stuff, you've got your passports, you've got all the stuff you really need, uh, don't ever worry, don't ever fret too much about not having something because you can always get it when you get there. So thanks for listening, and uh, I'll be seeing you soon.